the world has changed. There's so many things going on. And if you're watching this video, it's because you are having issues with your time sharing schedule or you're thinking that you need to change your custody arrangement. Hi, I'm Vanessa Vasquez from the Vasquez Delar Law Group, and I'm here to talk to you about post-judgment modifications. The first thing you need to know is that you have to have unanticipated but permanent changes from the time when you reached your agreement to now. That could be anything from a change in your schedule to perhaps your ex has moved away and now you're living far away from each other. The second thing you need to know is that your agreement must be in writing. In order to make sure that you're able to enforce any agreement that you reach with your ex about the time sharing, it has to be in writing and it has to be ratified by a court order. Simply because you've discussed it with them and you've reached a verbal agreement doesn't mean that they can't come back and then change their mind and try to impose the prior agreement on you at the time. Look, if you're watching this video, I know that this can be overwhelming. As a mom myself, I know that my kids are the most important thing to me, and I know that they're the most important thing to you. So give us a call if you have questions about how a modification could work for you and for your family.